G'day guys. We are here today. Now I'll tell you why we're sitting in the shed. We're in the shed here because this is about, this is a little video clip about Simon's best recoveries. There's a few of them, mate. There's a few of them. <laughs> now the reason why we're gonna show you, it's actually Simon's top five. Now the problem with Simon's recoveries is Simon seems to end up in a lot of holes. In my defense, mate, the little buggers jump out at you. <laughs> oh, I gotta say, this is not how I pictured my morning this morning. Sort of nice leisurely drives through the bush, and go and catch some fish. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like they move around a bit there, mate. <laughs> oh yeah, they do. But you always seem to end up in the holes, mate, and I always seem to be recovering you out of the holes. I like your, I like your work, <laughs> mate. I like your work. Check this out, guys. This is number five of some of Simon's top recoveries. Okay. I'm up ahead trying to clear the track because we've been like days on this track and we're getting nowhere. I'm gonna try and get out of this before anyone comes along. I thought I was gonna get around that, but that's a negative. Oh, there he is. Here comes Jace now, so I'm busted. Ouch. He's in a hole. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Go wide if you can, go wide, real wide. It's gonna go into the next hole. <laughs> Mate, you're probably I know what was happening there. He was probably eating something and he completely missed seeing yeah, this huge, yeah. you know, this massive hole that he uh, fell in. Fair call, mate. <laughs> Fair call. That's probably exactly what was happening. <laughs> All right, so we're looking down here now. So we'll keep scrolling down, mate. Scrolling there's, a down. Whole, there's a whole list of these things here. Can you believe there's a whole list of them? Like, um, I mean, there's some serious I'd like holes. to say no, I, I don't believe, but <laughs> yeah, I do believe it. All right, so this one, you've got to remember this one. Now this area was decimated by a cyclone last year. All the trees on the open ridges copped the full force. Bit of a maze through here, isn't it? Yeah, I tell you what, that cyclone made a mess of this country, didn't it? You wouldn't want to have been in here when that was happening. <laughs> You'd be ducking for cover, wouldn't you? How many trees are on the deck? Yeah, there would be some uh, hairy stuff hanging around in here with all these trees falling over. Mate, I've just fallen in a big hole. A bank or something's given way on me. Holy crap, doesn't look good. No way. Well, they nearly gave me whiplash. I thought I was going over. Did ya? <laughs> Here we go. Oh my goodness. Geez, that's close. I'm gonna have to get the shovel out and gonna have to pop it up with the winch. I'm a bit worried though, Jace, if we go forward, what's gonna happen to that toolbox? Do you want me to just pull you backwards? There's supposed to be more to that car looking from here. There's like, there's like a whole front bit missing. <laughs> All right, mate, you ready for this? Yeah, nice and steady. I'm pretty sure you just told me the reason why you even fell in that hole. Oh, nice. Very nice. Mm. I mean, that wasn't too painful. <laughs> the truth? <laughs> well, what we said was the truth. <laughs> 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 He reckons he didn't yeah, see it. Yeah. He didn't see it all right, because he wasn't even watching. No, he was looking at the iPad. Yeah, I was looking at the iPad. <laughs> Go straight in the hole from hell. But that particular trip, like I'm not kidding you, that particular trip, that was like the easy bit for the whole trip. Oh, I was so. The entire trip turned out to be an absolute horror trip. We must have broke everything we could find and we limped into cans, mate. I'll tell you what, there wasn't much left. I didn't, that I, didn't wasn't think, broken. I didn't think we were getting out of that track that time. No, that, track, that was a serious track. But that was the 200, mate. You know, we come out of that track and we only had front wheel drive left. Yep. Yeah, okay, so that's number four and it's still, it gets worse, trust me. All right, mate, this is number three, number right? Number three. Yes, now this was in the west coast, like the deep, south coast of Western Australia. It was cold that trip. Too. It was very cold, very cold. And mate, do you remember it? Play do you it, remember mate. it? Play it. Yeah? Play it. Yeah. All right, let's have a look at it. It's pretty good this one too. This track's all time. Now we go the sand dunes in the distance. <laughs> the track's just a bit washed out here, mate. Yeah, you'll be right. I'll have to put my radio down and concentrate. Holy crap. It's proper washed out. Full in that hole. Go on, straddle it. Maybe. Good binder. 
Oh, going in, going up. Holy shit. Holy quadruple shit. Ah! Ah! I see you stopped. Mate, I could be in a bit of bother. In a bit of bother. Yeah, just hold, mate. I'll come and help you. Just hold. Don't worry, I'm holding. I think there might be a little wet patch on my seat. In fact, I'm pretty sure there's a little wet patch on my seat. The hell are you doing, mate? <laughs> I'm, not I'm not touching the bank yet. I bet that wheel's off the ground, isn't it? Oh, like, I'd pitch a tent under it. Is there anything I can hook the winch down to, Jase? Oh, yeah, I can pull you down. We're going to have to, because I can't. My weight's not doing anything. No. Oh, it's not doing anything. Huh? Do you remember that? Oh, I do remember that. That was, yep. a, that was a wheel stand from hell. I thought I had that too. That was the 79. He was in the 79 on that one. Hey, and, and just to get everything clear, I didn't actually pee myself. You didn't? I thought I might have a little bit, but I didn't. Okay, well, there you go, folks. Those seat covers are still good. Oh, that feels a bit All better. All right, just hold it. Fire it up and start driving. Just use drive out of that, mate. Yep. Just watch me. Nice and steady, that's it, nice and steady. Steady, steady, that's it, keep that wheel. Nice and steady. That's it, that's it, bit more. We're good. Take tension on the winch. Trailer's hanging in there, eh? Yeah, no, trailer's going well, mate. Trailer's good. Just go steady, yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good, just go steady. Anyway, so yeah, you, you were driving those sandy, and they're really tight tracks over there. There's oh, no doubt about that. Tight, yeah. and you've got this shrubbery, and, and of course, these are the tracks coming down onto that, that main yeah, beach, yeah, and of course, they're washed out the buggery. And of course, we're trying to head down and get across, but yeah, he's fallen in the hole in the 79. So. It was too cold to get out and check the track. We just drove into it. <laughs> Another one of those I weren't watching. <laughs> Well, as you see, there's a bit of a theme going on here, mate. Yeah. All right, so that's number three. That was in Western Australia. That was, that, mate, that's some serious wheel lifting. That's proper. All right, let's have a look here. This is number two. Now, number two. Geez, there's, there's, another, there's another one in here. It's exactly the same car. It's the same car. Now, this one, this is actually on Unleash, this one. And we had Moggy. That's right, we did too. Yeah, we had the Mog. Now, that's right. you, you know how big and wide the Mog is, don't you? I was following you through that track. What was that track called? Oh, I don't know. I can't remember. They had no name. No, but anyway, here, right. watch it. You watch it. There you go, watch it. Have a watch. You have a look. Did you know there's a big hole here off to the left? Yeah, there's a few big holes. No, I'm in it. You might, can you reverse back? I think I need to hook my winch to you. And his wheels are high up in the air. He slid down into the hole. By the time I got to him, he looked like he needed a stepladder to get out of his door. Oh, So I raced back to Simon, and he has the, the, the big gully or the big washout that I'd straddled. He'd missed it, and he'd slipped off one edge of it, and the, his tire drops into it, and the thing's just like, Boom! And he's dropped it right on its side. He's, he's almost rolled the truck. Now you remember? Now I remember. Now you remember. Oh, so I remember. I, I was, was in the mog. following you. Yeah, I was in the mog, mate. Did you get on the two-way and say, Simon, watch out, there's a bloody great hole there? No, you didn't. What, what am I? What am I? What am I like the guy that tells you where the holes are? You don't, you, you don't, you don't even you look where you're going and you fall in. When you're in front, in you normally do. See, I relied on that. Who does that? Who does that? <laughs> Try and get some weight over here. Yeah. All right, the trail's the only thing holding you here, you know that. I know that. That's it, that's it, steady, steady. That's it, that's it. <laughs> that was epic when I went in, let me tell Just you. hold him there, hold him there. So the trailer's gonna fall in it now, but it, yeah, you just can't do much about it. The trailer's gonna straddle it. Go steady, steady. That's it, nice and steady. No, trailer's gonna straddle it, eh? <laughs> Sweet. You went in it. Oh, oh, that was close. That was very close. You're through, mate, you're through. Anyway, the thing was, the, the Unimog has this massive wide track, and of course, it just drives straight over the top. 
Like that wasn't a hole for you, Mog. It, so was, it was a brow of a hill like this. And I, I go, don't know I what can, it was. I can remember it. And I'm looking over. I couldn't see over the front of the I road. don't know what it was. I just drove over it like it was like a yeah. little a little rut. Yeah, so I followed you, and then yeah, well I didn't. I didn't straddle. Sorry, mate. I was yeah. driving the uni mog. It just thought it was a rut. <laughs> so you just missed. Yeah. I did. I couldn't even see it. I come over. I'm looking. I'm looking, and I just watched your back end driving out of here because here's your track. Yeah, I just straddled it. Yeah. And I watched your back end of the night because I was thinking, oh, maybe there's a hole there because the track over like over that side. And I just watched your life. Oh, it's all good. And I come looking, I'm looking there. <laughs> <laughs> I nearly swallowed up. Let the me tell you how gone. scary it is when you're driving along <laughs> and next minute the whole truck just goes. <laughs> it's pretty scary. <laughs> you'd think you'd pay more attention to what's in front, wouldn't you? You would. All right, this is number one. I reckon this would have to be one of the best. This would have to be the best recovery slash Simon's stuff up without carnage <laughs> that could have been a lot worse. It was that, controlled. How's that sound? It was controlled, and let's face it, you were involved in this. <laughs> you were heavily involved. <laughs> watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, and everyone will see that you were heavily involved in this incident. I was there to help. Quite possibly go on my side at this point. It's a 90 degree corner, there's a bank in my way, there's nowhere to manoeuvre, my trailer's all hung up, big angle, all bad. So he's he's come in on the high side and it looks on a real angle, it feels like it's gonna tip, it feels like it's gonna tip. And he said, look, hang on, hang on, I'll jump on the side. I'll, I'll probably put my weight on the outside edge to try and counter lever it. Here we go. Let's go steady. Yeah. Let's go steady. I'll keep the weight out here. As much as I can. The well, Jason's hanging off the side and I saw what he ate for breakfast. There's no way his little ass is going to hold this truck on the deck. And he's coming around and I'm like, oh no, she's, she's all right, she's all right. And he's going, no, nah, no, nah, it doesn't feel good. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no, Here no. we go. No. Oh, I knew it would. I knew it would. Bring your truck back. Here's me laying on my side again. All bad. All bad. All bad. Just, no, no, go, grab your remote. Grab your remote. <coughs> I'll pull you straight back over with the wheels. Where is it now? I can't find it. You remember that one? I do remember that How one. How good was that one? <laughs> See, I am getting good at rollovers. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, there's no doubt about it, mate. You are getting good at rollovers. Um, if you look at the theme too, there's holes, rolls, and 79s involved. And uh, some of those were chasing a mog. Maxie's never been on its side. No, but the first one, it nearly went on its side, so... <laughs> <laughs> but I, I especially like the part where um, it, I think without that boat on the roof... Oh, it would have been carny. It would have been a mess. Be like, it would have fell down and actually smashed the side of the truck. Yeah, and the roof of that truck would have been a mess. Could have been a lot worse. And you guys too would probably recognise that track, where that track is. That's on the um, the Overland Telegraph track, and that's coming across um, the, the little the, log yeah, bridgey little thing, log bridge yep. thing yep. that everyone looks at it and goes, oh my God, oh it's going to collapse. All right, yep. And then you come around a, a sharp corner. And look, let's face it, the 79s. It was a trailer. I couldn't get around the corner with the trailer. Without the trailer, it would have been fine. And what it started doing first, and I thought it wasn't going to work, if it's sort of dragging it along the embankment, it's not really tipping it. All of a sudden, it starts to load the front of the truck up. <laughs> go back, go back! <laughs> and sure enough, over she comes. Drive forward, drive forward! You gotta love that! You gotta be good, it'll come back in, come back in, come back in! Woo! Yeah! We're back on our feet, baby! I've had a bit of practice at the old rollover, and I think I'm getting better. So there you go, guys. There seems to be this little common theme going on here with Simon's best recoveries. Um, if you want to learn something about four-wheel driving, don't be watching this clip. Nope. Watch out, <laughs> Watch out for those holes out there. They'll get you every time. Well, they get me every time. But what you definitely you'd have to say, look, there's no doubt about it, you'd have to say that we were fortunate enough that the recoveries weren't, you know, they, they turned a little bit pear-shaped. But we got ourselves out and we didn't have to get recovered. Yes, and we did have a plan B. And remember, that could be a little bit like insurance. Sometimes you think you need it. But when you do, if you're going to get recovered from a remote place, it's going to cost you a lot of coin. That's it. So it's like 
I think I'll get insurance just in case. Hell we yeah. don't have a plan B.